First you'll want to install the SDK, which can be found in the description of the video. Then once you're in Unity, you'll want to head over to the SDK tab, type in the name of your loading screen, and click Create. After that, you can click on Scene to view the template loading screen. You can find the files for the loading screen in the loading screens folder. Once you are ready, drag in the images you want to use as sprites for the loading screen. Next, on the image, make sure that texture type is set to sprite, that generate bitmaps is turned off, and that compression quality is set to none. After you've changed all your settings, make sure to click apply. The resolution of your image also needs to be 2048 by 2048, otherwise the size will appear differently in game. Next, you can drag in your sprite and modify it however you want. Please note that if the sprite appears behind or in front of other sprites, you need to change the order and layer. You can go ahead and delete the template sprites. Now you can continue decorating your loading screen. Please note that changing the color on sprites will not show in game. So use the default white color, and change the color in the image itself. If you change the ground texture, make sure to also change it on the loading screen package script. Even if you don't have ground, make sure the loading screen package always has a texture, otherwise the loading screen may not appear in game. Now you can go ahead and delete the forward that's there for scale. When you are ready to export your loading screen, Go to the SDK tab and click Build Asset Bundles. Then wait for Unity to finish. When it's done, you can go to the Asset Bundles folder. If you don't see anything there, right click and click Refresh. Then you should see your loading screen, ready to be put in game.